Hello guys, back again. It is always cool when someone takes old technology or, or something old we all know and love and makes it modern. In this case, we're talking about an Indiegogo project called the Armiga, which is actually a modern take on the Commodore Amiga, which was very popular for some people, a computer. And, and one of the reasons we're doing this is as uh, technology seems to get older, especially with some computers or game systems, the prices just get really expensive and the average person either can't afford it and it's not necessarily just the price of, hey, I need the computer. In some cases, hey, I need a computer. I need this exact monitor to work with this exact computer and all the track down software and stuff. So in this case, it's a minor take. Now, here are the functions to this. First of all, before we get to, to that, in the Indiegogo project, they're looking for $140,000 uh, to fund this, to, to make this uh, little system because it is re relatively small. In a, in a you know white case says Armiga on the top and it actually has a floppy disk drive in this day and age a floppy disk drive is, is you know blows people's minds but in order to secure one of the first systems you must you know give $139 if you give $139 then you'll get one of these systems if you love the Commodore Amiga and I'll tell you why you're gonna love this uh, if you're an Amiga fan first of all to understand the system this system is running on Raspberry Pi uh, with an Amiga 500 emulation of one megabyte of RAM, that is what uh, basically what you're getting when you get this. And here the here are all the features. It, it, the specs are this: a powerful dual core ARM CPU, uh, a two USB host, so joystick, mouse, and keyboard support, as well as pen drives and HDDS. So you know you want to worry about hooking that stuff up if you want to use it. An SD card slot to save your ADFs. Or bring in new ones and obviously SD card slots SD cards are very popular and it only makes sense to have it in this to easily to transport stuff into the, the system it also has an Ethernet connection obviously to, to connect your uh, obviously your network uh, it also has an HDMI port so you can hook this system up to your modern monitor or TV because obviously if you try to hook Amiga if you could it hook Amiga up to your monitor TV or monitor it would obviously look very pixelated uh, because it stretches on the screen and it was made for certain monitor certain monitors so now here's the features you're getting if you were to buy this Armiga a full Amiga 500 emulation and they they target the Amiga 500 obviously because a lot of people know and love that Amiga right now 90% of the discs are actually be able to run on it so 90% of, of all the discs released for it can actually run on this system which is really good um, boot to Android because see since this is an Android operating system it is actually the Android 4.2.2 which is the latest Android operating system so that when you are not playing you also have the power of the Android so you actually in a sense get two you get an Android op, you know you can get an Android operating system and you can play your Amiga so in a sense it is a tool dual system if you wanted to use it that way it also has automatic disk load like the original Amiga insert a disk and off you go a disk dump to create images of your favorite games and keep them on your SD cards uh, it has disk swap so just insert a disk when it's when it's dumped and then when you need to change disk, just change this FTF server uh, no need to take the SD off to manage the ADFs. Just do it from your computer. Uh, graphical menu, uh, which obviously it's a usable, you know, just a usable menu for people. Uh, game saves, which is obviously would be a big deal for people to be able to save their games and resume where they basically left off. Uh, auto save. So if you're one of those people who forget to save, you can set it to auto save. And of course, uh, Screenshots, which you could take screenshots to share with your friends. So a lot of cool features that weren't in, obviously in the original Amiga. Uh, a lot of cool things you could do if you wanted to, or maybe you want to get get it just to mess around with it, because maybe you know you want to see how much it is to you, the real Amiga, or you, maybe you never had one and you want to get one. This could be a cheap alternative, and it is a very small case. It kind of reminds me of like what an old floppy drive, you know, used to look like, except this case is like got like ridges on it and obviously it says Armiga because they can't use Amiga but my question to you is what do you think about this Armiga that's basically a modern Commodore Amiga with an Android operating system 
uses Raspberry Pi. Would you be interested in getting something like this to hook up to your monitor TV and monitor? Because I think that is the biggest appeal to this, is that you can play your old software on your monitor television, on, you know, your your monitor monitor, and obviously the fact that you obviously can, with SD cards, you could obviously probably, you could play software, put software on there, since there is emulation on the system, if you necessarily don't have that. So if you're someone who doesn't want to have to track down the disc, but it is good for people who have the disc because they can just put it in and play if they wanted to. So I'd love to hear your guys' opinions. What do you think about it? Would you donate to a project like this that takes something old and modernize it to use it on, you know, obviously modern televisions and have some modern features in it? Or are you one of those people that's a purist that you only want the original hardware and nothing else? Anyway, guys, love to hear your opinion. Thanks for like, liking, subscribing, commenting. I really do appreciate it. And I'll talk to you guys later.